my hair such a mess. <coughs> my hair such a mess. Um, basically, people say, people say, oh, well, the metabolism is controlled by the uh, such and such gland, but the mind controls the body. So you could say, if your mind, if you, if your mind sees your body in a certain way. And if that sticks in your mind, then your body's going to be that 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 weight or that size or whatever. It's very difficult to change. You have to change your mind before you can change your body. It's, I know people who've tried many diets and haven't been able to lose weight. The reason is, is the mind controls the body. Basically, the inner controls the outer. So inner space controls the outer space so you can be fit you can be healthy you can be running around doing magazines you can be running around doing leaflets you can be swimming a lot or whatever and you can still be the same weight because your body because in your head your your image in the mirror is what your body is so for people who are struggling to lose weight they need to take in mind how powerful the mind is the mind is very powerful. Um, virtually every part of your body is controlled by the mind. Your heart wouldn't be beating now if it weren't for your mind. If it weren't for your deeper mind doing the job. Everything in the body has a job to do. And it's all controlled by the deeper mind. That's why they say mind over matter. Which is where you try and control your mind to change your outer circumstances. So, this only is that, connectiva.